Hi everyone, I'm Greg Golgowski and I'm standing here in Harmony Square. The question for today is, what's the purpose of public art? Behind me is the, is the sculpture called From a Barn. It's made of pieces from the old hay barn that used to be here in Harmony uh, as part of the Tripoli Ranch. And its purpose in part is to recall that agricultural heritage that Harmony has. But there's a lot more art around town. This sculpture uses a seed roller from the Tripoli Ranch and animal silhouettes and is called Florida Natives. Standing with it is another Florida native, Mr. Birchwood, who was a Tripoli Ranch manager for 40 years. Some of Harmony's art helps you figure out where you are, like the golfer, while others serve as landmarks, like this butterfly looking over traffic at Five Oaks Drive. The Angel of Harmony greets visitors near Harmony's western entrance and may be motivational and inspirational to those coming to the Harmony Community School. But a lot of the art is a little more down to earth. Ever sit on a butterfly and watch sandhill cranes? Or maybe walk through a birdhouse village? Some of the art is meant to get a reaction. We've been asked before why this dead tree in the dog park hasn't been cleaned up yet. Even the splash pad can be considered art and may help to remind you of places you've visited before. Time to But art presented to the public doesn't need to be spectacular. You can find it tucked away in many front yards around Harmony. Art can be very embraceable. Check out the public art in your community or come visit ours. You'll see why it contributes to our favorite places at Harmony. Mm -hmm.